I'm Josephine Gorshoff here with Jim Raw, and today we have an amazing 45 minute full body with weights and cardio intervals workout. We're going to start with a warm up for about five minutes. Every fourth move is going to be a cardio interval. Each move is 45 seconds with a 15 second break. All right, enough talking. Let's get started with our warm up. March it out. We're just warming up the body right here. Whew, it's gonna be a great workout today. I hope you are ready. I'm using five pound dumbbells. You can use any weight you like, lighter or heavier. It's your workout, you choose. But we are doing compound movements, meaning upper and lower body together, which is most metabolic, bo metabolically efficient. That was a tongue twister. Say that one 10 times fast. So you might wanna use a lighter to moderate weight for that. All right, go out wide. Get those knees up, bring it back in. So we're going narrow to wide, just warming it up. Heart rate should slowly be coming up. Getting a little bit warmer. Good, now march it out and do some arm circles, really opening up that chest, warming up the shoulder girdle. Good. I'm getting warmer, you. And let's take it backwards. Good, now reaching side to side, pivoting on the toe, warming up the torso. Nice straight arms. Your body temperature should slowly be coming up. Good, now tap it out, side to side, squeezing the back, squeezing the shoulder, lateral side taps. Good, let's add a hamstring curl to that. Good, stretching out the front of the leg, kicking the glutes. Last eight. Good, march it back out. Good, now we're gonna do side to side, side lunges. Whew. Pushing through the heel, warming up the glute and the lower body, stretching out the inner thigh. Are you getting warm at home? Hope so, I am. Last five, four, three, two, one. Good, march it out. Now we're gonna do some toy soldiers. Stretching out the back of the leg, the hamstring, tapping the toe. Try to get that leg up high, swinging it right to left, opposite hand to toe. Last couple here, five, four, three, two, one. Good, march it back out. Let's take it up a notch with some light balls on the feet, side to side. Give me some front punches, warming up that upper body a little bit, staying light on the balls of the feet. Heart rate should be coming up, oh yeah. Ten more seconds here, then we'll go into some light jump rope. Last five, four, three, two, one. Little jump rope, side to side, our invisible jump rope. Last ten seconds here, stick with it. This is just the warm up. We're not even into the main event yet. And I'm getting warm. Last five, four, three, two, and one. Back to marching it out. Good. Go a little wider. Let's give me some neck rolls, warming up the neck. Good. Other way, switch. Good, shoulder rolls back. Good. Last five, four, 
three, two, one. Take it forward, bend the elbows. Five, four, three, two, and one. March it back up. We're gonna pick it up into gear right here with some glute kicks. Almost done with the warm up. Make sure your body is feeling warm, loose. Always make sure to warm up before you do any weightlifting exercises. You don't want to get injured. You want those muscles to be pliable, nice and warm. Because if you lift a weight and your muscles are cold and tight, that leads to injury and that's no good. We don't want that. Make sure to drink your water, stay hydrated during this workout. All right, some jumping jacks. All right. Woo. Your heart rate should be up by now. Ten more seconds here. Good, march it out. Let's take three deep breaths. Inhale, exhale, blow it out. Inhale through the nose. Exhale, blow it out. Inhale. Exhale, blow it out. Good. Twist that torso. Make sure the spine is nice and warm and pliable. Five, four, three, two, and one. All right, let's get into it. Grab your weights. 45 seconds on with a 15 second break. Our first move is a lateral squat to narrow squat. So, lateral squat, narrow squat, lateral squat. Here we go. So narrow in the center, lateral to one side, narrow in the center, squeeze those inner thighs, narrow to the other side. <sighs> Pushing through the heels, squeezing the knees together, chest is up, core is tight. Form is everything with these moves. Do not do a move if you can't do it with good form, because again, that leads to injury. So nice. Slow and controlled, never swinging the weight. Last 10 seconds here, then we're moving on to the next move and we get a quick 15 second break. In five, four, three, two, and one. Great job. Next move, alternating knee to chest with a bicep push out. So bicep, push out, hold, switch. Bicep, push out, hold, switch. Here we go. Working the core, bicep, shoulder, chest, switch. Balance too. Balance is very important to work in any exercise routine you have. As we get older, our balance can go. So we definitely want to work the abs, core, and balance. Switch, hold. There we go. I love working balance moves because my core is engaged, lower abs are activated. Oh yeah. Last 10 seconds here, then our next move. Five, four, three, two, and one. Great job there. Next move, wood chopper to squat, alternating. So we wood chop with the weights, come down, pivot lunge, Front squat, weights in front. Then we switch sides. Here we go. Three, two, one. Wood chopper down. Come all the way down. Weights to the front. Squat down. Other side, wood chopper. Reaching up. Coming down. Center. Squat. Reach away. Come down. Pivot. That's your wood chopper. Center squat. Other side. I know it's a lot to remember. You're doing great. With the weights in the front of the squat, your core should really be engaged. So keep those weights there. Here, down, front squat. Switching sides, reaching to the sky. Down, front squat. Great job, you know what time it is? Cardio time. It's our cardio intervals. Drop your weights, 45 seconds on. We have four fast feet into an in and out jack. So we go one, two, three, four, in, out. Here we go. One, two, three, four, 
in, out. Great job. One, two, three, four, in, out. Nice work. One, two, three, four, in, out. One, two, three, four, in, out. Let's go. One, two, fast feet. Three, four, in, out. You got it. One, two, three, four, in, bend the knees, out. It's a jack for the bottom of the feet. In, out. One, two, three, four, in, out. Your heart rate should be coming up. One, two, three, four, in, out. One, two, three, four, in and out. A little extra there at the end. All right, grab your weights. Back to our resistance moves. We had a single leg reverse lunge to tricep swing. So, reverse lunge on one side, tricep swing. Then we'll do the other side. Three, two, one. Reverse lunge, tap down. Tricep, swing it up overhead. Reverse lunge, tap it down. Overhead tricep. Reverse lunge. Tricep, swing it down. Tap it all the way down. Your back knee should be 90 degrees when you reverse lunge. We still have to do the other side. Chest is up, core is tight. Five, four, three, two, one. Great job, we gotta do the other side now. Breathe, catch your breath, doing awesome. Starting back up in a few seconds. Make sure to do the other side. Here we go. In three, two, one. Reverse lunge, tap down, bend the back knee, come to center, overhead tricep, swing it down. So you're allowed a little swing as you bring it up and over. Normally I say don't swing the weights, but to bring it up and over smoothly for this move, it's okay but I'm doing it with control. You see that front raise here in the center and then an overhead tricep. Great job at home, keep it up. You can do anything for 45 seconds, right? Five, four, three, two, one. Great job. Next move we're gonna do is an alternating curtsy lunge to wide row. So alternating curtsy lunge, come up, wide row, switch. Here we go. Alternating curtsy lunge, hinge over, wide row, switch. Curtsy lunge, get low with it. hinge over, wide row, switch. Wide row. I want you to get low, bend that back knee, squeeze the back. Working the rear delts and the back with that wide row. Back is flat, core is tight. A few more seconds here, hold on to it. Five, four, three, two, one. You know what time it is. Drop your weights after every three resistance moves. One cardio move. All right, alternating cross punch to jump squat. So we go one, two, three, four. You like it? Here we go. One, two, three, four. Jump squat. One, pivot. Two, three, four. Yes. One, two, three, four. Get some air. One, two, three, four. Jump, get low, get some air, come on. One, two, three, four. Your heart rate should be coming up. One, two, three, four. Really pivot. Use the torso, use the core. One, two, three, four. Jump it up. One, two, three, four. Last one. Woo! Love that move. It's so fun, isn't it? All right, grab your weights quick 15 second break. Next move we're doing here is the alternating front lunge to hammer curl in three, two, one. Front lunge, 
hammer curl, switch, front lunge, hammer curl, switch, bend the back knee, keep the chest up, core is tight, slow and controlled, not about speed when you're using the resistance moves, you can go fast during the cardio moves, during the resistance moves, I want slow, intentional, mind-body connection, right? So take your time. A few more seconds here, hold on to it. Last one, great job. Next move we're doing, bent over twist. Two, narrow squat overhead reach. So we go one, two, three, four, narrow squat, reach up. Here we go, bend over. One, use your core. Two, three, four, narrow front squat, overhead reach. Hinge over. One, two, three, four, twist the abs. Narrow squat, overhead reach to the sky, you got it. Reach up, hinge, one, use your core, two, feel it in the obliques, three, four, narrow squat, reach to the sky. Last 10 seconds, hold on to it. Come on, work those abs, work the core, legs and reach. Nice work. Next move we got is a lateral raise around the world. Staying on one side with a bicep curl. So we go front, side lunge, reverse lunge. Here we go. Front lunge, bicep. Side lunge, bicep. Around the world to a rear lunge, bicep. Staying on the same leg. Front lunge, bicep. Side, bicep, stay low with it. Rear, bicep. Then we're gonna do the other side. Coming up shortly. I'm sweating, are you? It is hot. Full body movements. Oh yeah, working it. Getting my sweat on. Working upper and lower body together. These compound movements really kick butt. Yes, they do. Nice job. All right, you know how to do it. Other side, front, bicep, side, bicep, Rear bicep, catch your breath. Whew. Around the world, here we go. In three, two, one. Front lunge, bicep. Side lunge, bicep, stay low. Come to center, rear lunge, bicep. So I want you to do the bicep curl on the actual lunge, not when you come up from it. So stay low, so it's like an isometric little hold there. Great work at home. You got this. Remember, you can do anything for a certain amount of time if you put your mind to it. It's all about the mind before the physical body. 10 seconds here. Almost there. Five, four, three, two, one. Great job. You know what time it is. Cardio time. Every three moves. The fourth move is a cardio move. Drop the weight. Here we go. It is a torso twist jump to straight jump. So we go one, two, three, four. Jump it up. Got it? Here we go. One, two, three, four. Jump straight up. One, two, work in the core. Three, four. Jump straight up. One, two, hinge over. Three, four. Jump and reach to the sky. One, Two, your abs should be working. Engaged. Jump to the sky. Jump it up. One, two, three. Really twist. Four. Jump straight up. Similar to the move we did with the weight. This is our cardio move. Cardio interval. Last one. Great job. Grab your weights again. Back to the next three moves. I know we're moving fast here. You're doing awesome. We have a lateral raise, then we have an around the world, 
Then we have a bicep curl. Here we go. In three, two, one. Lateral raise, palms face down. Now face the palms out, bring it up and around the world. Come on down, bicep curl, yes. Lateral raise, palms face away from you, around the world, bicep curl, great job. Breathe through it, you got this. Working shoulders, biceps, core, feel it, oh yeah. Doing great at home, keep it up. Compound movements, doing multi-joints. Last 10 seconds. And done, great job, drop your weight. Good luck, right now we have a little break, so grab water, say hello to your partner, check on your kids and let's stretch. Two minute little break here to do what you need to do, towel off, stretch it out, grab a drink of water. And switch. Good. Stretch out that quadricep. Feel this right here in the quadricep and the glute and switch other side. Stretching it out, take this time for you. This is your quick little break to do what you need to do. And then we gotta get right back into it. 100% commitment is what I need from you, okay? I give you these little breaks so you can come back determined, ready to go, giving it all you've got. All right, quick hamstring stretch. Stretch it out, back of the leg, ooh, that feels good. And switch. 10 more seconds and then break is up. So come on, wrap up whatever you're doing. Grab your weight. Gotta get right back into it, okay? Here we go, three, two, one, break's over. Let's go, 100% commitment. Grab your weight. Next move we're gonna do is a front lunge, balance bicep shoulder reach, switch. Front lunge, balance. Bicep, shoulder, reach. Here we go. Alternating front lunge. Then I want you to balance. This is the hard part. Woo, woo, woo. Bicep, shoulder, reach. Great job, switch. Front lunge, balance. Use the abs, use those lower abs. And reach, all about balance and core stability here. Front lunge, balance. Try not to tap the toe like I just did. Switch, front lunge. Bicep, shoulder, reach, switch. Almost there. I love these balancing moves because I really feel it in the lower abs, do you? Woo. Great job. Next move we've got, we're gonna serve the platter out laterally. Serve the platter front. Lean over, narrow row. All right, here we go. Bicep, shoulders, and back. Let's boogie. Serve the platter out to the side. Serve the platter out to the front. Keep the core engaged. Narrow row, hinge over. Reaching out. Reaching forward. Hinging over, squeezing back. Nice work. Ooh, I'm feeling this in the abs, too. Lean over, so your palms face up when you reach out. Reach front. Lean over, squeeze the back. You're doing great. Woo, upper body right here, baby. Feeling this one. Almost there. And done. Great job, drop your weights. You know what time it is. 
It is time for cardio, baby. So we're gonna do one, two, three, four, cross country skier, jump squat in and out. Here we go, three, two, one. We go one, two, three, four, jump in, out. One, two, three, four, out, in. One, two, three, four, out, in. Let's go. Use your arms for those cross country skiers out and in. Heart rate should be going through the roof right now. Ten seconds. Last few. Woo! That one got me. I'm feeling it. Shake it out. Woo! Grab your weights. Back to our resistance training. Alternating pendulum squat to tricep kickback. So we squat, pendulum, tricep kickback, then other side. Here we go. Squat, pendulum, lean over, tricep kickback. Squat, pendulum, lean over, tricep kickback. Squat, pendulum kick, lean over, tricep kickback. Oh yes, full body, baby. Kick it back, get those triceps up high. Remember, this is not about speed here. This is about form, full body workout. And done, great job. Next move, halo around the world with an alternating cross punch. Bring the weights together. Halo around the world, cross punch. Here we go. In three, two, one. Halo around the world, keep the core tight. Cross, punch, good job. Halo around the world, slow and controlled. Cross, punch. Bring it up and around, working shoulders and abs. Cross, punch, good job. Abs are really engaged. Try not to move the back when you do the halo. See how everything's tight, slow and controlled and pivot on the feet when you do those cross punches to engage the abs. Few more here. Last five, four, three, two, and one. Great job. Next move, we got a double squat pulse to heel raise. So we go one, two, pulse, heel raise up. Up on the toes in three, two, and one. So we double pulse and then up on the toes. One, two, chest up, pushing through the heel, working the glutes and the quads, and then the calves at the end with that heel raise. Whew. One, two, double pulse, heel raise. Great job. Heel raise. You're doing awesome at home. How you feeling? Woo! You got this. This is a hard workout and you're doing awesome. 10 seconds here. Get low in that squat. Last one and done. Great job, drop your weights. Cardio time, regular jack to scissor jack. All right, so it goes like this. Regular jack, scissor jack. You ready? 45 seconds on the clock, let's go. Regular jack, scissor jack. Now we go a little faster if we can. So scissor the arms and the legs. Yes, this is gonna get your neural pathways going. I know it looks a little confusing. Stick with it, you got it. Arms are straight, working the shoulders. Getting that heart rate up, let's go. Ten seconds, stick with it. This is cardio burst right here. Five, four, three, two, one. Great job. We're gonna take it down to the mat. 
and keep it going. All right, so you made it down to the floor. We got 10 more moves to go, 45 seconds on, 15 second break. You will need your dumbbells for some of these moves. First move, we're gonna go into bird dog. So opposite leg is straight, opposite arm, keeping your core engaged, tricep kick back. We'll do one side and then another. Here we go. Keep your abs tight, glutes tight, legs straight and pointed. Kick it back. We're gonna stay on one side for 45 seconds and then do the other side. I love this move because we're working core, triceps, and a little bit of glute in there because my leg is pointed, strong, and activated. Oh yeah, I'm feeling it. Glad we made it to the floor. You did great. This is a tough workout. Full body compound movements with cardio intervals. Love it. All right, 10 seconds. Then we switch to the other side. Five, four, three, two, one. Woo! Feels so good. Let's take it to the other side. Here we go. Opposite legs going out. Bring it up. Tricep kickback in five seconds. Four, three, two, one. Let's go. Always keep that elbow right by the rib cage. The arms up high, squeezing back. Believe it or not, you feel it in the glute too here. Doing awesome. Hold on to it. You can do anything for 45 seconds. If you put your mind to it, you can do it. Almost there. Hold strong, abs engaged, belly button to spine, back flat. Whew. Last few seconds and done. Great job. Next move, come on to plank tap out. So you can have your hands on the ground or hold the dumbbells. You're gonna tap right, tap left. Here we go, five, four, three, two, one. Bring it up, tap right, tap left. Good, belly button to spine. I love planks because they are a full body move. Working the core, working the upper body, chest and arms. Also, if you keep your quadriceps and your glutes activated, you're getting a full body workout here. Plank toe tap outs, 45 seconds. Hold strong. Woo! It feels good, it's burning. Last 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Great job, come down to your knees. 15 second break. I'm sorry, I've got some bad news. You gotta do some push-ups. I know us ladies hate them, but gotta keep our chest strong and our back strong. If you wanna come up onto your toes, you can do it on your toes all the way down. Push it straight up. If you need to do your knees, do your knees like so but I want the chest to the ground. Here we go. Woo! This is a full body move. Go at your own pace. It's not about speed. It's about getting the chest all the way to the ground. Down and up. If you need to drop to your knees, that's okay. But I want that chest to the ground. Don't use your forehead or your chin to get extra Space there. Look a little bit ahead. And 10 seconds. And done. Great job. I know everybody hates push ups, but they are so good. Strengthen your chest and your back. You ladies don't want back problems, right? All right, next move back to our plank. Plank shoulder tap. Here we go. Three, two, one. So tap, tap. Tap. Right here, you want to keep the core really stabilized. So don't rotate out like that. Stay with the hips facing down. And with the hips pointing down to the mat, tap it out. Whew. 45 seconds here. Doing a lot of core work. Still full body moves though. Planks, push-ups, all the good stuff. Want to finish off with a bang today, right? Finish strong. Almost there, 10 seconds.
and done. Great job. A few more moves. Let's come on to our back. A few more core moves. Some bicycle hold crunches. So it goes like this. One, two, three, four, hold. And then we do it again and I'll cue you through it. Here we go. One, two, three, four, hold. One, two, three, four, five, six, hold. Go into eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, hold. Go into ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, hold. Almost there. Ten more seconds. Let's go. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, hold. And release. Whoa, those holds really get you, don't they? All right. Grab your weights. Glute bridges with a double pulse. So up, pulse, pulse, down. Here we go. Three, two, one. Bring the weights up. Pulse, pulse, down. That's one. Bring it up. Pulse, pulse, two. Bring it down. Bring it up. Pulse, pulse, three. Pushing through the heel. Up, pulse, pulse, four. Great job. Up, pulse, pulse, five. Pulse, pulse, six. You're doing great. Your glutes should be burning, especially with this added weight. And done. Woo! Great job. Next move we're going to do is a straight leg bicycle hold with the weights this time. So we reach, reach, reach. All right? So it's a straight leg bicycle hold with weights. Here we go. In a few seconds. Get ready. You can do it with or without weights. Let's go. Reach, reach, reach. So I'm getting a little shoulder work in here, core work, full body movements, hitting it all up. Abs, upper body, glutes, triceps, chest, you name it, we worked it. Oh yes, 45 seconds here, reaching to the opposite foot. I call this a straight leg bicycle with a push with the weights. Last 10. And done. Great job. Next move, chest press with a glute bridge. Like so, working the core, chest, and glutes. Here we go in five, four, three, two, one. Reach up, squeeze, pushing through the heel. Full body movement. Squeezing. And a couple more seconds here. And done. Great job. All right, final move of the day. Here we go. It's a, I call it an around the world plank. So you come into plank hold, you lift the right arm, the left arm, right leg, left leg, all right, and go around and around in circles. Here we go. One, two, three, four, full body here, reaching, reaching. Try to keep steady, squeezing the glute, squeezing the abs. Working the shoulders and the chest. Straight legs, straight arms. Last 10 seconds, you got this. 
Hold strong. Five, four, three, two, and one. You did it. You finished your full body workout. Let's stretch it out. I'm gonna stay on the ground for this. Come forward. Get rid of those weights. You're done with those babies. Reach, inhale, exhale. Flat your, flatten out your back. Try to get a little deeper, exhale. Good, come on up. Bring the heels together. Open up the hips, lifting the hips off the ground. Rock right to left, releasing the hips. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Hold here, rolling out the neck. Switching other side. You did amazing today. You, you rocked it. Give yourself a pat on the back. You did this. You finished an awesome workout, burned calories, raised endorphins, feeling more confident, stronger. Bring this over. Inhale, exhale, twist. You had a nice deep torso twist, stretching out the IT band. Come back to center, untwist, switch the other leg, bring it up and around. Inhale, exhale, wrap it, and twist, look to the back. Feel a nice stretch in this IT band here. Come back to center, open up the legs wide. We're gonna inhale and we're gonna come on down, stretching out the inner thigh. Woo. Try to get the back flat, chest to the ground, go a little deeper with, it, with each exhale. Good, slowly come up, shake the legs in. Woo. I'm feeling those inner thighs. We're gonna bring the legs around us. We're gonna come into upward facing dog. So we come down, stretching out the core and the lower back. Inhaling, exhaling. Pushing back into downward facing dog. Pedaling out the feet. Stretching out the calves, right and left, pushing the heels to the ground. Good. Hold here. Walk the hands to the feet. Keep the knees bent. Grab the elbows, rock right to left. Releasing the neck and the back. Shake it out, release the hands, roll it up for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Come to center, inhale, reach long fingertips. Exhale, reach it over to one side. Come on up. Inhale, exhale, reach to the other side. Good, grab the hands, arch the back up, release the neck. Good, come forward, arch the back up like a cat. 
come on up, shoulder stretch. Last one, other side. And you are done. You did a great job on your 45 minute full body with weights and cardio intervals. See you next time.